Let's pray before we begin. Lord please let us understand your word and put it in our hearts. May it shape our lives to be more like your Son. In Jesus' name we ask, Amen. Chapter 7 Now it came to pass when the wall was built, and I had set up the doors, and the porters and the singers and the Levites were appointed, that I gave my brother Hanani and Hananiah, the ruler of the palace, charge over Jerusalem, for he was a faithful man and feared God above many. And I said unto them, Let not the gates of Jerusalem be opened until the sun be hot, and while they stand by, let them shut the doors and bar them, and appoint watches of the inhabitants of Jerusalem, every one in his watch, and every one to be over against his house. Now the city was large and great, but the people were few therein, and the houses were not builded. And my God put into mine heart to gather together the nobles and the rulers and the people, that they might be reckoned by genealogy. And I found a register of the genealogy of them which came up at the first, and found written therein, These are the children of the province that went up out of the captivity of those that had been carried away, whom Nebuchadnezzar the king of Babylon had carried away, and came again to Jerusalem and to Judah, every one unto his city, who came with Zerubbabel, Jeshua, Nehemiah, Azariah, Rehemiah, Nehemani, Mordecai, Bilshan, Mispereth, Bigvei, Nehem, Baana. The number, I say, of the men of the people of Israel was this. The children of Perosh, two thousand and hundred seventy and two. The children of Shephatiah, three hundred seventy and two. The children of Era, six hundred fifty and two. The children of Pehath Moab, of the children of Jeshua and Joab, two thousand and eight hundred and eighteen. The children of Elam, a thousand two hundred fifty and four. The children of Zatu, eight hundred forty and five. The children of Zechai, seven hundred and three score. The children of Binuai, six hundred forty and eight. The children of Bibai, six hundred twenty and eight. The children of Asgad, two thousand three hundred twenty and two. The children of Adonikam, six hundred three score and seven. The children of Bigvei, two thousand three score and seven. The children of Aden, six hundred fifty and five. The children of Ater of Hezekiah, ninety and eight. The children of Hashem, three hundred twenty and eight. The children of Bizei, three hundred twenty and four. The children of Herif, an hundred and twelve. The children of Gibeon, ninety and five. The men of Bethlehem and Netopha, an hundred fourscore and eight. The men of Anathoth, an hundred twenty and eight. The men of Bethazmaveth, forty and two. The men of Kirjath, Jearim, Kephira, and Beeroth, seven hundred forty and three. The men of Ramah and Geba, six hundred twenty and one. The men of Michmas, an hundred and twenty and two. The men of Bethel and Ai, an hundred twenty and three. The men of the other Nebo, fifty and two. The children of the other Elam, a thousand two hundred fifty and four. The children of Harim, three hundred and twenty. The children of Jericho, three hundred forty and five. The children of Lod, Hadid, and Ono, seven hundred twenty and one. The children of Sena'a, three thousand nine hundred and thirty. The priests. The children of Jediah, of the house of Jeshua, nine hundred seventy and three. The children of Immer, a thousand fifty and two. The children of Pasha, a thousand two hundred forty and seven. The children of Harim, a thousand and seventeen. The Levites, the children of Jeshua, of Cadmiel, and of the children of Hodeva, seventy and four. The singers, the children of Asaph, an hundred forty and eight. The porters, the children of Shalom, the children of Ater, the children of Talmon, the children of Akab, the children of Hatita, the children of Shobai, an hundred thirty and eight. The Nethanims, the children of Zihah, the children of Hashufa, the children of Tabaoth, the children of Kiros, the children of Sia, the children of Padon, the children of Labana, the children of Hagaba, the children of Shalmai, the children of Hanan, the children of Giddel, the children of Gehar, the children of Riah, the children of Rezin, the children of Nekoda, the children of Gazam, the children of Uzza, the children of Phasia, the children of Besai, the children of Meunim, the children of Nephishasim, the children of Bakbuk, the children of Hakufa, the children of Harher, the children of Baslit, the children of Mahida, the children of Harsha, the children of Barkas, the children of Sisera, the children of Tema, the children of Neziah, the children of Hatipha. 
the children of Solomon's servants, the children of Sotei, the children of Sophereth, the children of Perida, the children of Jaela, the children of Darkon, the children of Giddel, the children of Shephatiah, the children of Hattil, the children of Pokereth of Zebaim, the children of Ammon. All the Nethinims and the children of Solomon's servants were three hundred ninety and two. And these were they which went up also from Telmila, Telharisha, Kirab, Adon, and Imma. But they could not show their father's house nor their seed whether they were of Israel. The children of Deliah, the children of Tobiah, the children of Nekoda, six hundred forty and two. And of the priests, the children of Habiah, the children of Koz, the children of Barzillai, which took one of the daughters of Barzillai the Gileadite to wife and was called after their name, these sought their register among those that were reckoned by genealogy, but it was not found. Therefore were they, as polluted, put from the priesthood. And the Tirshatha said unto them that they should not eat of the most holy things till there stood up a priest with Urim and Thummim. The whole congregation together was forty and two thousand three hundred and three score. Beside their manservants and their maidservants, of whom there were seven thousand three hundred thirty and seven, and they had two hundred forty and five singing men and singing women. Their horses, seven hundred thirty and six, their mules, two hundred forty and five, their camels, four hundred thirty and five, six thousand seven hundred and twenty asses. And some of the chief of the fathers gave unto the work. The Tirshatha gave to the treasure a thousand drams of gold, fifty basins, five hundred and thirty priests' garments. And some of the chief of the fathers gave to the treasure of the work twenty thousand drams of gold and two thousand and two hundred pound of silver. And that which the rest of the people gave was twenty thousand drams of gold and two thousand pound of silver and threescore and seven priests' garments. So the priests and the Levites and the porters and the singers and some of the people and the Nethinims and all Israel dwelt in their cities. And when the seventh month came, the children of Israel were in their cities. Matthew Henry Commentary on Nehemiah chapter 7, verses 1 to 4 Nehemiah, having finished the wall, returned to the Persian court, and came to Jerusalem again with a new commission. The public safety depends on everyone's care to guard himself and his family against sin. Verses 5 to 73. Nehemiah knew that the safety of a city, under God, depends more upon the inhabitants than upon its walls. Every good gift and every good work are from above. God gives knowledge, He gives grace, all is of Him. And therefore all must be to Him. What is done by human prudence, must be ascribed to the direction of divine providence. But woe to those who turn back from the Lord, loving this present world. And happy those who dedicate themselves, and their substance, to His service and glory. Thank you for listening. If you want to know more about Jesus and what the Gospel means to you, then hit the video shown on the left of the screen and please don't forget to subscribe. May the Lord Jesus Christ bless your day.